I spent a lot of time talking to people in India from the scientific community, the education community, to try and find out the state of the education system in India as it existed uh, 12, 13 years ago and what the gaps were. And a consistent pattern began to emerge. The chalk and talk system, I talk, you listen kind of thing, was numbing the brains of millions of kids across India. And there was a general frustration with things as they existed and a yearning for something to happen to change this. So we said, look, what the system probably needs is a very healthy dose of the creative spirit. If this country is going to change, if it's going to be innovative, if it's going to produce interesting products and services for its citizens and for those of the world, then uh, injecting this creative spark becomes critical. So we said, that's the gap. And to make it all happen, we should spark curiosity. So the way we're doing it is, think of a, of a traditional business. You have a factory and you have a distribution system. In the case of Augustia, the factory is our campus. It's what we call a factory of ideas, where we do a lot of R&D on new ways of learning, new pedagogies, teaching learning methods. We make models and experiments, and we pump them through our distribution system which we call our hub and spoke model, which consists of fixed sign centers in different districts across the country, where children and teachers come and learn and do projects and activities and all the rest of it. And then spokes consisting of mobile labs, which fan out to parts of the country that are very remote, where children and teachers have absolutely no access to the sorts of teaching learning methods that we have. So today we are a team of nearly 500 full-time people. Uh, we were probably 200 five, six years ago, so we've more than doubled. We touch a million children a year, at least three or four times a year, each child directly face to face. So that makes us probably the largest mobile hands-on science education program for kids, disadvantaged, economically disadvantaged kids in the world. Uh, we've got 75 mobile labs and 31 science centers and we operate a program called Operation Vasanta where we have night school classes in nearly a hundred villages. To some extent people like Mahatma Gandhi that was their vision that ground up from the village would emerge change makers if you like. Change makers who understood the reason for why you know people had problems and then work towards changing those situations to improve their lot.